need more strong strong mind oh. strong body strong heart okay you're maybe you're vomiting or what yeah. maybe you're like this What's up gang? What's up? Welcome to my channel. So I'm back with my another episode of Mate and we're gonna discuss about his experience, thoughts, good time, bad time in his abseiling journey. So yeah, we're gonna discuss about his abseiling journey. Gang gang, this is the view. And this is the one. Okay. Hey, welcome to my channel uh, bro introduce yourself first your name age please where did you claim from what's your name what is how old are you <laughs> good morning gang gang i'm ryan casano from philippines i'm uh, 40, 44 years old uh, i'm uh, absolutely in absolutely in here in wellington good. like this work uh, but i'm a simple guy only with my team uh, so Shout out, shout out to your channel and uh, more, 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 more uh, followers. Okay, sweet ass. Um, so, he's Ryan from Philippines. Shout out to Philippines. Um, how did you get into this abseiling job? And what was your first job before abseiling? Uh, how did you start the abseiling job? My job before in the Philippines is uh, I work in uh, one big company, mm -hmm. uh, San Miguel Corporation. I, I work in the uh, uh, logistic staff for the the product of San Miguel Corporation like bear, everything, uh, foods, uh, oh. in canned foods. Okay. And I work more than 14 years in Philippines and after that I go into abroad in I first work in Qatar in Aksuna Company. Okay. with my RP uh, Filipino people in uh, Nepali people or any people in after one year in my company in Aksuna uh, my company is giving to training for auxiliary or pro boxes in uh, Singapore okay. that time I take level 1 uh, last 2017 uh, January 14 mm -hmm. I take level 1 I pass the first time I take the level 1 with the Filipino team in one, Fili uh, one Nepali okay. in, after that, in Singapore I, yeah, in Singapore, uh, the uh, training center is uh, Istraa, ah, okay. Singapore Ropaxis Association. Okay. And after that, and I come back in Qatar and start the work for the Ropaxis, cleaning the glass, everything, mm -hmm. fixing the glass, painting everything. And, and after that, I work in Qatar more, uh, mostly two years. Mm -hmm. And after that, in, I, my company is Send, send me there in the Oman. Okay. Oman Muscat Airport and I cleaning the maintenance glass cleaning in the airport glasses. Uh -huh. All glass in the airport. Fixing uh, glass, glass yeah. maintaining glass. Yeah, maintenance cleaning, okay. uh, painting, uh, 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 replace with the glass. Oh, okay. Everything. And after that, um, I work in four years in Muscat International Airport in Oman. After mm -hmm. that is I come here in the New Zealand with helping my friend with uh, mm -hmm. Jonathan Simeon mm -hmm. now I, I'm still here in the New Zealand right. in Wellington so yeah, four, four, four years four years in Middle East yeah in two Oman, years in Qatar two years in Qatar, two years in Qatar and yeah. then four years in Oman Middle East yeah in Oman okay total five years of yeah. work no six six yeah six okay so yeah 
So this guy have a lot of experience in rope access, abseiling. Um, he used to work in Qatar before, and then Qatar and Oman. So yeah, now I'm gonna ask about the certificate, gang gang. Which certificate does he have? Um, what's your abseiling certificate? Uh, when did you take your certificate, bro? And ha ha, can you explain about your certificate more? What's your certificate? Uh, yeah, again, my certificate is uh, I I take from the Singapore. Mm -hmm. uh, that one, uh, level one. Mm -hmm. And I work in uh, I work in the Middle East most six years, right? Mm. And after that, uh, not giving to renew my certificate from my, our company, mm. but. Uh, I going here. I, I come here in the New Zealand, mm -hmm. but the second uh, time is uh, giving the our company with the renew for my level one. Uh -huh. So now is my certificate is, is from the Irata. Uh -huh. Yeah, that one only. Okay. okay. So you are Irata level one. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a Irata level one. Mostly eight years working. Eight years working. Yeah, in, in do the level one. You, do you do you know the Irata number of your? No, the tone, I think the tone not, not, not allowed to, you know, oh, to say because okay. the tone is uh, this one is uh, confidential. Private, yeah. private, okay. Because the other people is making the fake certificate and use the tone for uh, yes, yes, going yes, the yes. job, but no, no, no proper training in the rope access. Mm. My, my certificate number, every rat, rat is not allowed to, to post in social media or mm. give the, the, the serial number. Okay, so, uh, yeah. so in Ilata, how did you, how can we upgrade the label? Do you have any idea about those stuff? We're going level two. Level like two, that. three, yeah. how many Iratas? Uh, for me, before I take here in the peak point uh, training center Irata here in Wellington in Porirowa city. Mm -hmm. uh, before I, I took my assessor back, uh, uh, told me uh, only 150 hours you upgrade by in the level two, but until now, I'm not, uh, I'm not preparing up for the label, term, but mm -hmm. I'm doing like that. Uh, I'm doing that maybe next year. Okay, I, so I'm doing level two. To go on level two, how many hours of logbook do we sign? Do we need to sign? So my logbook is more than 2,800 hours. Okay, you have 2,800 hour, yeah. 2, hours yeah. of logbook sign. Nice. To get on label two, we need 1,000? Yeah, that 1,000 is enough. Every, yeah. every, we start from the label one is 1,000 hours is enough for the taking the label two for mm -hmm. the Irata training. Oh. Enough the 1,000 hours. But my hours is much, too much. Oh, okay. Almost 2,800, I think, like that. So soon you're gonna take a label two? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Yes. I think, I think maybe next year. Next year? Next year or this year after my. Oh, maybe. I don't know. I'm uh, <laughs> preparing because need money. Okay. I pay my own money, not the company. Okay. All right. So he's level one IRAT uh, certificate, same as me, and then uh, yeah, he has a lot of experience of building maintenance, window cleaning, window window repairing, and other stuff. Let's move to the next question. Um, the next question is: Have you ever faced a hard time, a scary moment while doing abseiling? Have you ever faced yeah. that moment? Mm -hmm. My experience about the problem or uh, I'm afraid of a scary moment and first in Middle East in Qatar, mm. I worked there in more than 80 floor. Uh -huh. But the problem, you know, too much hat. Uh. But the glass, like this, shoot the glass, like glass, uh, four, time, four times or six times the, the impact of the hat. Uh -huh. In upsilling time, one drop in 80 floor is, after you finish the one drop, your dress is sweet or too much sweet <laughs> like that and after need more water and sometimes too much pain in your body and crying like that but here in, but here in New Zealand one of the problem is the weather sometimes uh, like this good weather uh -huh. sometimes uh, raining mm -hmm. now my hand is not no feeling in too much pain only that one but the, about the work my work about the work no problem uh, work is no problem yeah. only the thing is weather yeah the weather only Okay. Big different. Ah, uh, Middle East is uh, too much hot. Mm. Here in Wellington, New Zealand is too much cold. Uh, Only that one, the different. What, what about the building structure? The if building there is, is overhang. What do you uh, think? Overhang sometimes. Now I already put it for, but I do, I do, I do my best because sometimes too much painting. Mm -hmm. But need 
need to technique for the how to clean the glass like that. Yeah. Uh, because oh, the very difficult, especially the overhang. Uh -huh. Yeah. In like aid climbing, everything. Uh -huh. Because through practice is, uh, if you're going the, the, the job of auxiliary or pro practice, mm -hmm. your mind is working for mm -hmm. the technique mm -hmm. every time, every time, every single time. <laughs> yeah. Only that one. Okay. So yeah, he's giving pretty good, pretty pretty good things, good ideas. Yeah, it's all about mind game, baby. Gang, gang. Uh, moving to the next question. Let's go. Um, last but the last but not the least, what do you want to say to the people who are already doing an abseiling job, and then who wants to do an abseiling job? What do you recommend? What do you recommend, bro? Uh, for me, for me, I rec for me, be be uh, before I recommend the uh, work of this one rope axis, uh -huh. need more strong, strong mind, uh -huh. strong body, strong heart. Okay. Because this one, if you have strong your mind, <laughs> you're maybe you're vomiting or what? <laughs> maybe you're like this. Uh, okay. Need it in a uh, good, healthy body. Uh -huh. Another one. And uh, uh, for the, you know. Like our team, like this, my my uh, co-worker is especially the team, team, especially the work of rope axis or auxiliary team is number one the co cooperation mm -hmm. because the, the, the sometimes the, the job is very very hard or very difficult. Mm -hmm. So need the need, need the for ex, need the communication and uh, you know explain the everything mm -hmm. because sometimes. In the work of rope access, very hard uh, situation. So need the uh, need the uh, you know the uh, cooperation one by one. Okay. In teamwork. In the teamwork. Yeah. Oh, only that one. And then safety. Yes. In the safety. Yeah. Especially the safety. Yeah, yeah. Number one, the safety. Safety is the first. Yeah. Okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you for being in our okay, video. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, Brian from the Philippines. Brian from the Philippines. Absolute. Level one, Irata, and he have renewed his Irata because his certificate was already expired, and then yeah, he renewed his level one Irata. So yeah, bro, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys like it. Like this, I'm gonna bring a lot of Absailer to share their experience, thoughts in my video and let me know in comment section what type of questions should i ask in your opinion guys from your opinion what type of questions should i ask to the app seller um yeah that's it uh so, okay yeah bear that's it see you in next video till then see you in next video till then stay safe and yeah, stay safe. Gang, gang. <laughs>